Hello, welcome back to the stream. Um, so yeah, not much really to say before we actually start playing other than one, I'm sorry we weren't able to play Aliens last week. That mainly came up because of a logistical thing with uni and a couple of other things. Uh, we should actually be finishing Aliens this coming Wednesday, which will be fun. And then after that, we're gonna have to figure out something new for Wednesdays. Um, aside from that, in terms of satisfactory, I played it a little bit the other day, just again to have the machines creating new parts. I didn't create any new machines. Well, I lied. I made one new machine, but that was purely another uh, energy generator, the biomass burner thing, just so I could um, power the... Where is it gone? Hang on. The thing that the automated system I had for making fuel um, so I could make it on a separate power grid. The, this stuff was already built. This is like the automated fuel stuff. I don't think it's... Okay, it's got a little bit of these, but not enough. Um, that was already built, but I just made a separate biomass burner for it so that when everything else broke down, it did it. Because it was generated power separately. So I had to stop worrying about that so much. Um, other than that, though, I have not built anything new. I have purely just... Um, uh, what's the word? Um let things run for a bit. Um, got new parts. Um, also because I'm paranoid, I'm gonna double check that. Yes, I am, I am, you guys can hear me, which is good, I think. Yes, you can also hear my mic, good. Um, awesome, I wasn't sure if that unmuted properly, but it looks like it has, which is great. Um, now, what are we gonna do this session? First off, I gotta check how much fuel I've got. Okay, good, it actually looks like I filled these up before I quit, which is good. And how much fuel have I gotten? We've got plenty of fuel. Okay, so we don't need to worry about fuel for a while. Uh, oh, that's another thing. I also topped up my ammo for the rebargain because this is good. Um, right, what's going to be our first main goal for today? Um, resource sink. We don't need a resource sink. Vehicular transport. Mm, 25 slot inventory has built in craft bench. Can be automated to pick up and deliver resources at other truck stations. Can you drive it yourself though, or not really? Either send or receive resources to vehicles as an inventory. Or... Okay, so it looks like that automate only. I don't really have a site B yet to require that, so we won't worry about that right now. We do need to do this at some point. Do we need it though to do the water pumps? Uh, which one was the water pump? Or was it one of the later ones? I don't remember. Uh, no. Is that one we had already done? No. I swear we had already unlocked the option to start working towards the water pump stuff. Guess not. Maybe one of these later ones. That's alright. We'll work with what we've got for now. Well, one thing I know we definitely need to start working on is this one. So we might do this one first. So I'll hand in the concrete to begin with. We can definitely get that copper wire off and done. And I could probably pick up the rest of the concrete anyway as well. That's cable uh, wire, 500, 500. That should be all the copper wire I need. I need roughly another 100 and a bit of concrete, which is being stored over here. Yep, that, that's fine. Actually, hang on, I saw there was a, excuse me, a small stack there. So I'll grab that one instead. No, oh, damn it, I thought that was going to pop them back in, but it's just split them. That's fine. There we go. Um, then we need the motors and, oh, I don't have the square frame stuff. Okay, we'll figure out how to bake that in a second. Um, for the moment, motors, motors. I think they're called, no, that's, they're not called motors. Um, rotors, sorry. Is it rotors? By the way, that's not where they're made. Um, where did I put them? In terms of things I've been doing since last session, I haven't really done a lot. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I did rewatch the uh, Infinity War Endgame stuff, which was fun. Did that with family in preparation for watching the second Spider-Man film, which I've seen before, but they haven't. That's been kind of fun. They watched Homecoming the week previous to that so yeah um 
But it, was, it felt like retreading ground a fair amount for me, mainly because I'd actually seen uh, Endgame and Infinity War earlier this year, just rewatching it on Disney Plus um, in one afternoon. So a lot of it I already kind of remembered. Homecoming, though, the previous week was really nice watching. I'm not sure if I spoke about that last week. Um, oh, you doing that? I'll take your resources. Thank you. Um, but you know, so that that was fun, and I'm looking forward to No Way Home. Which I won't spoil the trailer for anyone who's not up to date or um, hasn't seen the trailer because it's a good trailer. Um, cool, so that's done. We'll stack that into one. That's the cable done. Rotors. Sweet. Now, what do we need to make you? Okay. I feel like we could probably automate that right now. Um, okay, what do we need? We need. Yeah, we're gonna need an assembler which needs that. Uh, cool. Uh, which I believe isn't being made yet. Being made here. Sweet. Uh, that. Cool. We've already got a splitter here, which is great. Uh, assembler. Other way around. Thank you very much. Uh, conserve space if possible. Sweet. Okay. Over my face. Oh, actually, this is going to cause some logistical nightmares if it's sitting right there. We're going to need to set it back a little bit. It's probably better off there. Cool. Have that there. And then what was the other thing? I think it needed poles, the weird pole things. I can't see it here. Hold on. I need to go into here. Uh, modular frame. Yeah, rods. Sorry, not poles. Uh, where are our rods being made at the moment? Um, it was over here. Yeah, I can see the nails coming from that direction, so the rods may not must not be far away. Uh, okay, so they're being put into there. Does it mean it's going? Yeah, it's going into here. Cool. Does it have a slitter already? It does, but it's already used up. Shit. Okay. All right. I need to figure out how I'm gonna do this. That one's being. I suppose I could offload some of this, because this, like, and put a splitter in here, because that's being really congested. So, uh, organization, splitter, 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 splitter. Where are my splitters? Even actually, is that a splitter right there? Yeah, cool. We'll just use that. I uh, want it to go. Actually, yeah, in that way. Um. Have, ah, no, I don't want to fall down. Really? 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 Okay. Uh, so that's not going to work. Uh, there we go. So maybe if I go... There we go, that will work. Sweet. And then I can... Bada bing and go over there. Yeah, cool. So, yes, yeah, so they're going to be watching Far From Home at some point in the future, which will be interesting because none of them aside from me have seen it. Um, ooh, is that going to. Is that going to. Oh my god, there. Really? Really? Okay, I'm going to have to think about this for a second. Hold on. Um, do I put that there? Go from there. Can I? If I have a location. Okay. Do I maybe need to climb to the top of it, perhaps? Hold on. For a second there, I thought that glowing stuff was a slug for a second. Um, cool. That should work. And then I should be able to feed it. Okay. Maybe not exactly like that, but. There. And there. And there. Sweet. And then I just had to hook that up. Cool. Sweet. Um, yes, yeah, so that's something I can look forward to. I've been watching a bit more of What If, which has been fun. I'm up to date with that one. Um, not the biggest fan of how they keep ending the episodes, if I'm being completely honest, with how they're a, lo a little bit ambiguous as it is. I know that... Oh, I need wire. Um, I know they're gearing up to have a fun episode where they all cross over again. But still, it's a bit annoying. Like, the uh, one we had a couple of weeks ago with um, Iron Man and what's his name from Black Panther? Um, 
Killmonger? Killmonger. I think Killmonger is his name. Um, so, yeah, that that ending for that particular episode was fairly irritating. Um, other than that, I'm really enjoying the series. I still think my favourite episode so far has probably been... Probably has been the zombie one, to be completely honest. Or the Doctor Strange one. The Doctor Strange one was good. So very good. Um, but, yeah, no. Um, Alright, we want modular frames. Thank you very much. Um, we want a storage thing. Um, but, yes, been watching a bit of that. Uh, I finally finished watching the last two episodes of Rick and Morty, the new season that came out. And... Fucking hell, that was a trip. Rick and Morty always is a bit of a trip, but still, a bit of a trip. Um, not sure where they're going to go from that ending, but that's fine. I'm not going to talk about it too much, because I know I'm in the um, hearing range of my sister, who I know, granted on an on-off basis, I believe, does watch Rick and Morty, and I don't really want to spoil the ending for it. Not that it's an ending of the series, just the ending of the season. Um... I do like how we got some nice sort of closure, kind of closure, on like the Tales from the Citadel episode that everyone went wild over when that first came out. Um, uh, please tell me it's run out and not because I need more generators. Please tell me it's run out and not because I need more generators. Um, but yeah, so that was interesting. Also started watching Skins on the recommendation. Oh, fuck. Hold on. 165, 164. Yeah, you guys should be fine, but you've broken down. Okay, so I could get another generator. That's fine. I can do that. Um, ah, but I need more poles. Um, but yeah, so Skins is interesting, dated, but good. Um, I would recommend Skins is like a UK um, teen comedy drama, if you haven't heard of it or seen it before. Um, if you enjoy sex education, I highly recommend Skins. Um, it's in that same kind of humour and vein, if a little bit more naughty's era. It was strange seeing flip phones everywhere. Um, but yeah, no, it was enjoyable. It was good. Um, and so I hope to continue watching that. Watch the first two episodes of that. Um, if you have seen the series, Cassie's a lovely character. I adore Cassie. Um, she reminds me a lot of, um... There's a character in sex, edu sex education that's very much like her. Um, I cannot remember any of the characters' names. But she's the blonde one who... I think starts out dating the jock, whose name I also can't remember. But he was the son of the principal. But she's the girl who was initially dating him. Um, and is one of the main character's best friends. I cannot remember any of the names. It has been a few... Wait, what am I... Oh yeah, I'm making a generator. Um, it's been a few months since I last watched that show, and I need to rewatch it for season three. Season three will be good. Uh, oh! Oh, have I already got the fuel pump stuff? Oh, fuck, I'm an idiot. Okay, well, have we got everything we need to do fuel pumps? We've got stuff being built, so we could actually do that. Let me make one more biomass burner um, so I can have everything still running in the background whilst we're making the fuel pumps. Um, but yeah, so we can do that instead then, um, rather than working on them, like trying to get modular frames by hand so we can do that one tier, we'll just let them build. Because we've now got all the automation for it, it's just a matter of letting it go. Cool, so that's in, that needs a connection, that's probably worth topping up everything else as well. Uh, oh, let's that and then oh that's actually the that's the one I don't want to connect it to because that's the that's the independent one um sweet that'll work and then if I go fuse boom that looks like it's working good alrighty um excuse me so let's sort out this pump situation. So, fluid buffer is not what we need to be with, I don't think. What we need, first off, what we need is coal. And then we need the fuel stuff. Now, 
before we go on the journey that we're probably about to go on to, I'm going to make a marker for both here. I actually probably don't need it for here because we've got the hub and space elevator point here. See it. But we're going to need it at least for the place that we're going to. Because I remember from the last time I made a playthrough of this, well, not that I made a playthrough, but I played through this game before. Um, there's a place off that way, I think, roughly. That's like this nice waterfall kind of area. And that has plenty of coal and water to pump from. So we're going to go there. Um, now, I need to make sure that I have plenty of what I need. So let's start amassing stuff. So we're going to need plenty of pipeline support. Uh, we're going to want plenty of Mark 1 uh, pipelines. Let's aim for at least 30. We shouldn't need any pipeline uh, crosses. We're going to need at least a few pumps. Um, pipeline support pump. Uh, we're going to need the actual big pump itself as well. Um, we, that coal generator, sorry, that's what I mean. Um, so we'll grab that, or at least, we'll aim for two. Um, we're going to need, to, we've got plenty of that, got plenty of that stuff. Um, we're going to make sure that we have plenty of that. And plenty for that. Um, I swear there was an actual thing that took it from the water. Water extractor, here we are. Aim for two of those. Cool. So we need. A lot of iron plate, a lot of concrete, a lot of copper sheets, a lot of iron plates, and a lot of rotors. And that seems to go off the side a bit. Okay, I'd rather have it like that. Cool. And we've got plenty of space in our thing, but things we don't absolutely need, I'm going to offload into here. So, it's things we don't need. We don't need flower petals. We don't need nails. Don't need random bits of wood for sure. Uh... We need plenty of iron rods. Rebars will need that for defense. We don't need leaves. We don't need limestone. I'd like to have those just for health's sake. Need the cable. Can I stack those there? Yeah, that saves space. Don't need a heck of a lot of these. We'll need a little bit to, um, what do you call it, power the pumps to begin with, but then after that they should be self-sufficient. Um, Do we need normal iron plates? Yes, we do. We need plenty of those. Okay. All right. So that should leave us with plenty of room, though. Um, so we will start collecting in abundance everything we need so that we don't run out. And hopefully we might actually be able to make more than two pumps, if possible. That would be fantastic. So we need... We, no, that's the wrong thing. We need rods. And I know it says only eight rods, but in abundance. Let's be, let's be careful about this. Cool. So we've got that in abundance. Cable in abundance. We we need that in abundance. Um, cable. Let's grab 400 of those to be sure. Um, rotors. We're going to need a few of those. I'm just like, fuck, we don't need modular frames. Um, and I'm glad I did run, let my computer run with this game for a bit, because then we probably do have all the things we need. Um, oh, we're going to need the reinforced iron plates as well, so we'll grab that in abundance. Uh, is this the one that makes... No, that's the modular frame stuff. Uh, rotors was off this way, was it? Why are you... Oh, you're backed up. Okay, well, I'll just take a little extra. That's fine. I'm sure it's fine if it's backed up already. Um, sweet. Um, so is that the one that makes the rotors? No, that's smart plating, which I don't need. Um, I don't think I've actually needed smart plating for anything. I've just started automating it from it. Oh, actually, I think I needed it for the space elevator, but that was it. Um, is it this one? It is this one. Fantastic. Oh, we don't have many of them. Ah, oh, but it's enough for what we want for now. So that should be okay. Um, it's not being backed up and that oh no that's the thing that it needs quite a lot of okay um oh that could be made a little bit up ah, but then we need more power 
Oh yeah, that's another thing I learned uh, whilst I was playing offline. I found out to actually overclock it, you need you need to move this little bar here, not just put things in there. Which, um, yeah, bit awkward. But at least I know now. Um, but at the same time, I don't really want to increase that just yet until I have more power. Um, so until then, um, copper sheets. That was the other thing we needed, which I think was being made over here, if I remember correctly. That's concrete, but we also need that in abundance. That would be fantastic. Grab a house in the flowers. Um, is it over here then maybe somewhere? Is it this one? Yes, it is. I can see it pumping through. Sweet. So let's grab a few of those, because I remember that you needed quite a lot of. Sweet. Um, cool. So we can't get any more reinforced iron plate because there's none more in storage. And we can't get any more on rotors because there's none more in storage. But otherwise, we've got everything in abundance. So let's make our way to the waterfalls. <clears throat> Sorry, feeling a little bit congested. Um, why is it when I always start the stream, I start to feel congested? Um, but yeah, no. Um, ah, also, that's another thing. I kind of decimated this forest um, whilst I wasn't streaming because I needed all the wood and, and bushes and whatnot for power. So a quarter of the forest here is gone. Um, I didn't quite realise how bulbous the world looked until I did that because I think in my previous playthrough I didn't take anywhere near this amount of trees and bush because by this point I was already I think I at least had one site off that way that was really crappy that at least had one pump it was a shitty one but it worked all the same and I was able to get enough power from it that I could get off of the biomass stuff but we've been really slow on stream um yeah but at least I think it's this direction Ooh, I should probably actually save before anything goes wrong um That's all good. Now, uh, I think it's in this direction. This looks right, I think. Um, or is it that way? Oh, fuck. I don't remember. Well, we'll, we'll walk about. Oh, there's a bit of mist. That, oh, actually, I don't remember the... Oh, we'll have a bit of a walk about. So we'll have a look and see. We'll know pretty quickly if we're going in the wrong direction because there won't be any water. And I vaguely remember the look of the biome as well. So I remember it was actually quite high up. So I don't think that's it, though. I don't think that bit's it, because um, it didn't have those pink trees. But is it this bit, maybe? It is this bit! Sweet! I thought we were going to come from across over there. But that's fine. Oh, and there's a slug. Fantastic. But yes, this, this place is basically a gold mine for water pumps. It's great. At one point, when I was last playing this game, I think I had about 10 or 11 different pumps. It got pretty tricky to fit them all in, but we, I got there. Um, now there was a slime thing across here somewhere. That didn't hit you. Oh, oh, you bounced me up in the air, but thank you. Oh, shit. I forgot you were there. Sweet. Is that both of you gone? I think that's both of you gone. And there's probably going to be a few more down there, so we're going to have to be careful. Reload that. Grab the slimy slime. Sweet! So this is actually closer to my base than what I thought it was. Granted, I think my original base was a bit further from this place than what we've got it now. But this is a nice setup. I'm really happy with this now, that we were able to get here really quickly. Because I remember it used to take me ages to get here on foot. Um, right, pale patties, thank you very much. Ooh, more pale patties, yes please. My health is actually okay-ish, so you should be fine. Um, okay, good, we're still in the, I just, I had a horrible thought that I didn't check full stream whether I had the Asher Stupid Moments counter up, but we do have it up, which is good. Um, right then, so, first thing on the agenda, Auto Extractor. Let's orientate it that way, and then we're going to need, oh, did I, oh, I didn't budget for a miner, because we are going to need a miner for the coal. That's all right. Um, oh wait, no, it's not alright, because you need the portable miner thing, fuck. That's fine, we needed to build a shed here anyway. Please tell me I have the thing to make a shed, please tell me I have 
that's the thing to make a shit. Um, was it either of those? It was the equipment workshop, I think. Yeah, I've got plenty. Good. That's lucky. Um, probably we just want to make it here then. Um, now, what do we need to make the portable miner? Portable miner. Oh. Just, yep, sweet. Got two of those so we can make the two different miner machines. Fantastic. Production. Miner Mark 1. Um, and in time we can update that to Miner Mark 2. Now I'm actually going to have to get out of that menu just in case anything sneaks up on me. That is hostile. Because I remember there was a few fire dog theme up ups here. I don't know what they're called. I vaguely remember they were kind of on... What the fuck are you? You're new. It's a creepy looking tail. Um, but I vaguely remember there was like coal over in this area and there was also coal all up here. I think. I could be wrong. They're also new. That kind of makes me feel a little uneasy. Let's get rid of you ASAP because you're going to be a pain in my ass. I can feel it. I got you two. more than two sh oh don't tell me there's two of them and there's one behind me yes there is okay come on I'm probably going to need a heal in a second sweet that's them sorted um yeah go that'll do that was more health than what I had before. Um, is this cool? Ah, this is cool. I would have thought it'd be black, not creamish, but that's fine. Um, sweet. And we probably want it to go outwards like that. That would be preferable. You're not hostile, are you? You look hostile, but then... No, you're fine. Okay. Um, sweet. And then we want the actual coal generators. What menu are they on? Here. Um, so we'll probably make one this way for now. Sweet. Um, let's think at least one of these up. And I do remember that. Actually, I can't remember if it was these type of miners or whether I, I had Mark IIs at the time, but I remember you got a shit ton of coal, so you would split them quite a lot. So we're going to make it a thing where I stop and start the thing every now and again. So it has so it has those standy bits. So it's not all just one consistent conveyor belt that gets demolished at once, is what I mean. Um, okay, and then what we need next is pipe. Which I may as well actually um, assign to six. No, six. Six. Aha! And then I'll have that one seven because we're going to be using this quite a lot in, in time. Cute. Oh no. Oh come on. I didn't even see you before at the entrance. You weren't here. There's going to be a lot of you here. Aren't Oh, can you stay still? Uh, is that the the reaper banning it around in its head really awkwardly? <laughs> okay, that that was a bit derpy. That's just did it get stuck on its own organs? Is that what happened? I think that's what happened. Hmm. Um. Alrighty. that we want it to curve around like that can serve space as much as possible we're definitely going to need a pump there in order to we're going to need a pump all the way up this just so it can actually uh what do you call it um push the water along i'm sure there's more um what's the word effective no efficient there's definitely a lot more efficient ways to do this i am sure i just don't know it Uh, is that 
Can I be close enough? Yes. Sweet. Okay. Now we're going to need pumps. And fuck, I forgot how big they were. Encroaching another thing. Oh, hold on. Um, does it not just snap on anymore? Oh, no, it does. Good. Okay. It does. It didn't seem to snap on properly, which was weird. Um, now we're going to need it to be like that. So it pumps water up that way. Now, remember, it took quite a few pumps to actually get it going. So we're probably going to want one as early as possible. Actually, you know what? Even let's have it leveled a bit, so then it has, we actually can get the pump in pretty soon before it's dire. Like that, and then in theory, yeah, we can do that before it, it's already heading upward. And then we'll have another one sit in here. Yeah, that's the right direction. Good. Good, 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 good. Um, have another one there. Another one there. And that should, in theory, be right, because the rest of it is level. Now we just need to power it up. Um, so, actually, what we first should be making is biomass burner. Um, to actually power everything to begin with, which I might actually have nearby the coal generator. It's times like this that I missed a little like um, whizzing car that you could get from the, the sink shop. But at the same time, it kept on overturning. I feel like that one's more of a joke, that it is more practical. Um, alrighty. So we want to hook that up to everything. Okay. Uh, oh, we're going to want a power pole over here and then have that go over to there. We won't worry about powering the other miner just yet until we actually have it hooked up to something. Because there's no point having it mine and not send it anywhere. Um. No, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Okay. Uh, do, do, do power that. And have another power line going down to there. Power that. Power that. Have another pole going to here, which will power that and that. Sweet. So that is everything that desperately needs to be powered for now hooked up. We just have to turn the biomass burner on. I don't think you need to configure any of these. We can test all the different pipes and make sure they are running, but I think that should work as is. Um, yeah, that should be fine. I uh, need to insert the fuel. But then the fuel should come in automated anyway. Um, hang on, is it producing power? No, it's max consumption. Okay, that's fine. Um, okay, so we'll consume 41 megawatts. How much is this going to make target 30 megawatts? We may need more than this. Oh shit, who's attacking me? Who's attacking me? Oh, fuck off. So we may even need to make a second biomass burner before everything works. That's all right, we'll get there. Oh, stay still, you little shit. Thank you. Your organ shell power industry. Um, all right. So we want to buy another biomass burner. Just pop it here. Put that up to. Yeah, that one will do. That's fine. Um, cool. So we shall put two hundred in there. Two hundred in there. Sweet. Says so that should now actually be powering everything. Now that's not actually going to make any power just yet because we still need the coal to come through. Coal miner is green. Uh, let me just get rid of these bushes so it actually looks nice and not so clipping into one another. Yes, okay, so the coal is being mined, so the coal's fine. How is the water looking? There's not already water in there, surely. 
It takes time. Yeah, no, there's no water in there yet. So where in the pumps is it up to at this point in time? Is it stuck anywhere? Because choke holds with the pumps up. Working in the way. Um, okay, there's no water at this point. Okay, so those two are green. So I'm going to take that as there's water in there. Yeah, there's definitely no water in here. So there must be water here. Uh, I think it's when they extended like that that it's got water. Oh, it doesn't show the water level anymore. It just shows you this stuff. Oh, okay. Flow rate, okay. Head lift, 1.8 meters. So it is coming up. Yep, water's there now. It's gone green. Sweet. Yep, so it is making its way slowly. It's reached here. Oh, I can go. Ah, there we go. There's the water level stuff I was looking for. Sweet. Cool. And that's just... The water's just hit that. That's now extending, I can see. Yeah. That's... That's getting better. I put the pumps in the right places. I wonder if I didn't need all the pumps I put down. But I don't care if it's working. Um, come on. If this, if this gets a large amount of water, then it means that it should all be getting to the generator, unless I've royally fucked this up somehow. Come on. That's a pretty good level. That's reasonable for it to stay halfway like that. And there's probably going to be some slight variation in height here. So. Yeah, that's rising. That, that water level's rising, which is good. I'm quite happy with it. We'll level here, yep. So this should be working. Which it looks like it is! Yay! We have power! Okay, right. Um, and I think we've still got enough to make another coal generator, which is great! Fucking A. Alrighty, so. I'm gonna make another one yeah. Which does mean we're going to have some crossover with this, but um, do I care that much? Not really, it'll be fine. Um, logistics, we should probably actually map that to 8, because we're going to use that quite often um, from now on. So I'll have that stacked like that. We'll have a conveyor belt going over it like that, so it's not clipping in with one another. And it can go into there. And then if need be, we can make a splitter there. Um, we need to make another pump, uh, not that type of pump, the other pump, uh, shit, where is it, is that production, water extractor, there it is, sweet, okay, and we're going to need to be conservative about the pumps we use this time, because we don't have a lot of rotors, and we don't really have the stuff we need to make rotors at this site, okay, um, Probably as close as a, to the beach as we possibly can would be good. Like there, that will work brilliantly, I think. Cool. Now we want it somewhat level so we can get a pump in to begin with, like that. I feel, and then we can have it go up like this. Have it go this way so there's still a bit of a walkway. Like, you can crouch under these, but it's awkward. And you, I'm pretty sure you can also make these stack, but then it makes it tricky to actually jump over them. Which I prefer to doing over crouching. I'm weird like that. Leave me alone. Um, yeah, I probably wouldn't mind the pole being in between there. Like, I can still reach for crafting purposes. Cool. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Because it is on the other side of this thing. Oh, we probably actually will need it to go on top of it for the so it can clear the um what do you call it? Uh the conveyor belt. It is gonna look a bit awkward like that, but that's fine. And then we're gonna need it to curve around like that. And go into there. Okay, I'm going to have to crouch under some stuff in order to get to things, but that's alright. I can work with that. Just if we can minimise it, that would be great. Um, 
All right, and then we need pumps. Okay, I have we have more pumps than I thought we would have. Okay, that's good. For some reason, I thought we'd only have ten rotors um, for the pumps, so that's fine. We've got plenty more rotors than I thought we would have. Um, right, we're gonna we still should be conservative about this though, just so we can get the most amount of power possible out of this place. Um, cool. Is that in the right orientation? Yes. Cool. So we have one there. Uh, that should send it fairly up enough that we can put it there. Hopefully, in theory, I think. And we can pop one up there. It's getting a little tight in here, but that's okay. Put one here. And then we're definitely going to need one here. So it can clear that height. Um, from there, in theory, it should be fine. Because then it's just downhill from there. Not in a bad way, but like in a good way. In that it's easy to pump. Um, cool, so we'll power that out. Um, that should get another pole. And so we'll power that send another, uh, actually we'll power that and then we'll send another pole. Slide under, do that, power that. Was there another one we missed? Or, no, we're good. Um, power that pump, send another pole, and power that. So that should now be pumping, I think. Why aren't you pumping? There we go. Yes, cool. So you're pumping. Great. Good. Sweet. Uh, flow rate is rising. Water level rising, which is good. Very good. Oh, that's... Oh, but that is rising. That is actually... Yep, that's rising. Good. Good, 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 good. Come on, flow rate. Still rising, come on, come on. Did it hit this yet? No, come on. Yes, okay, come on, get that flow up, get that flow up. Sweet. Yep, water level's coming through. That's pumping in there. Yeah, water's coming through there, so that's fine. Come on, pump, let's go. Come on, get that flow rate. Come on, get that flow. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yes. Okay, that should be fine. Um, yeah, that's plenty of water level. Um, water level here, rising quite quickly. Come on, still rising, still rising, still rising, still rising. Good. Come on, flow's going up. Good. Water levels rising. Sweet. I think I think our pumps are good. Um, so now what we should be doing is powering the miner because I think I've already hooked it up conveyor belt wise, haven't I? Yes. Okay. Um, let's make a new power line because that's about to run out and connect that. Uh, where's? Oh, I had three back up there. Cool. Sweet. So the miner uh, should be sending stuff through. Is water coming through here yet? No. Through here? No. Here? No. Oh. Slowly. Slowly it is coming through. Come on. Yeah, it's coming through. Good. I wonder if it's going to go down again, though, quite drastically when it actually reaches the bit where it goes downhill. Mm, staying steady there. How's this bit going? That bit's fine. That bit's quite low. Although then again, it's going downhill. And that bit's fine. 
No connection. Ah, did I not actually connect that? Uh, oh, I didn't connect it. I thought I connected it. Okay, hold on. There we go. Um, sweet. Now is it producing power? Yes, now it is producing power. Sweet. Cool. So, we are going to put a marker here. Uh, where does my marker go? There. Pop that there, configure it, and we're going to go um, water pumps. Sweet. Beacon. Why the name go? Right. Okay, fine. And we'll have the water thing look like that. Water pumps. Enter. There we go. Sweet. Done. So that will now appear on our radar, which is great. So now it's just a matter of powering and making a power line all the way back to the main base. And then this stuff should constantly just keep going, which is great. Um, and if we can make more of these, then I will be delighted. Because these things are fucking great. Um, except we need to be in range for where we want to build the damn things. Why is too long? Why is it blue? Oh, the wire's red, but the pole's blue. Okay, so if I pop it, poop it, pop, pop, there, pop it there. That should be fine. Good God, if I was pooping out a whole power line, good God, help me. Um, and then the floor is too steep, is it? Ah, oh, but it's blue there, so we'll pop it there. Yeah, yeah. Um, if I keep going, is it gonna? No, nope. floor's fine, good. No pop-ups, no pop-ups. Power oh, bite is too long. Pop it there. Keep going. Or even I might even no, it's floor t floor is too steep if I put it there. Okay. Uh we're gonna want to curve around in a second, so I'll put one for fuck's sakes. Speak properly, Asher. Uh pop one there. Pop one there, and then we should be able to just go in a straight line home. Oh, it's the dog things you can feed things to, and then they find things for you. I forget what they're called. They're nice. Um, keep building stuff. I think it's the first time I've seen them um, so far. Like, I haven't even seen them when I've been playing off-stream. I think the first one I'd seen for the first time, last time I played this game, before I started streaming, was in that waterfall area. So it makes sense we'd see one around in that area. Um, why well, it's too long? Okay, bring it back a bit. Put it there. Well, we're almost home. Yeah, we're really close. This is great. And then these wire um, things will also act as like a little pathway uh, breadcrumb thing to go, yep, cool, we know where we're going. Um, in order to get from pl place A to B, which is great. Uh, now, how are we going to connect it up with the main power is that one sweet that's perfect and then we'll just create a new power line like that so if i go to the biomass burners that should factor in a lot more power coming through now which is good now the question is are those pumps alone going to be enough to power everything which i don't think it is because the it, it itself is making 130 watts over there so let's see what the max consumption is max consumption is 256 uh, wait, no, that's not true. Sorry, capacity's 400, sorry. Um, and max consumption is 256. Okay, so we are going to need a lot more pumps in order to have it power our whole thing self-sufficiently. Um, I can work with that. We can make more pumps in time. So let me quickly make sure that all the things here have, got, have got enough fuel to keep going. But that should mean, as well, if we want to keep more buildings for now, <clears throat> we've got the infrastructure to do so, which is great. And we have less reliance on these things, at least gradually. Oh, fuck. I know they're docile. I know they're docile, but they freak the fuck out of me every time we're underneath one. Um, cool. 
All right, top these up. Um, that's topped up. That's topped up. Uh, that needs topping up. Needs topping up. And I may as well top this one up. It's not being used in the current power grid, but it's good for when we're automating stuff for fuel. <coughs> Um, so that's all good. I'm glad the stream's holding up because I was really concerned about tonight because I was having internet issues earlier, but I think I did sort those out before stream. So I'm happy that has worked. Uh, oh, we have a power slug, of course. Yes, we can do that. Um, what's the thing to turn it into the other thing? Shower, power shards. Tell you what we can do. We can probably overclock some more stuff now that we've got the extra capacity, which is great as well. So let's quickly do that. Um, now we wanted to overclock the rotors for sure. Because we definitely need more of those if we're going to make more pumps. Um, is this the rotor? Yes. So let's actually pump it up to 200%. And then that should make them a bit faster. So that's what the normal rate is. Target protection rate is now 8 per minute. Which... Mm, that's as good. That'll be good. But we need more screws. I thought we were already going crazy on screws, weren't we? Yeah, we're already going fucking bonkers on crews. Um, so what's our issue? Okay, you're just a greedy one. Got it. Um. Hmm. Alrighty then. Um. Not sure what more we can really do about that then other than find a way of making more screws with a separate machine um well for now until we sort that one out where is it offloading the screws to because what i might uh, there because what i might do is i might just give it a bunch to to go with for now just so we can get those extra rotors um uh, what's something else that we can top up and like move the overclock bar on because we did actually put a lot of overclock stuff into things um there yes that would be fantastic um hmm. okay so that's a merger that's fine um that also goes into storage or it goes into where is this where is that going into ah, I see that's going into that machine or it's going off that way so yes let's overclock that a bit more <coughs> god damn it um yeah cool so that'll do 30 per minute now which is good system seems to be holding up which is awesome uh that doesn't need the overclock that hasn't got an overclock thing in it good good um, do we need to overclock that? No, that's pretty congested as is. In fact, we can probably, I think we can probably remove that thing actually, to be honest. Um, we'll see how that goes. We don't need to overclock that. We're good on concrete. Um, how are we for the copper wrap thing in my box? We've got plenty of those. We don't need to offer, overclock those. Um, we should actually probably overclock stuff like the modular frames, maybe. Um, but I also want to make sure I know what's being overclocked already and what's got things in it. Um, but I don't see any more things that have the thing in them, the, the overclocking thing, that we haven't already dealt with. Did this one have an overclocking thing in it? No. How quickly is... Oh, it's burning through those screws really bloody quickly. All right, have a bit more then. Um, okay, so that's everything on this side that's being overclocked, I think. So let's have a look at the other side over here. Now, this thing had an overclock thing in it from memory. No? Okay. What is that making? That's making... Okay, we don't need that to be overclocked, I don't think. Oh, actually, overclock might not be a bad idea, but we'll see. Um, That's not getting a lot of reinforced iron plates anyway, so we're better off overclocking this first and going boom. Um, and then that's 
Oh, now it's going to do five per minute. Oh, that, that won't do at all, I don't think. Yeah, that needs three per minute. So uh, we're going to put in another one and go boom. Uh, but it needs more screws. Fuck. Okay. Um, right. Never mind then. That's probably why it's taking so bloody long. Um, all right. Well, we'll put that back down to 150. We'll make another thing that makes some more nails, because goddamn, we need some. Um, and we will feed that into the system. And we might overclock that thing. Okay, alrighty. Cool, so we've already got a thing that we can get it to split off from. Oh, is this a merger? No, this is a merger. How quickly does it need the stuff? It needs 25 per minute. How much does, does this produce? That produces 15 a minute. So if I do leave that on its own, it won't produce enough. But if I put an overclock thing in it, that's still not enough. Okay, that's not worth it. Fuck. Okay. We'll let that continue merging. Um, that's fine. Um... Hmm, how do we want to do this then? So that's already got a split of stuff going on. And that's being spread pretty thin. There's plenty of stuff in here though. So Roche is having a shortage of parts? Oh, it's going to have a shortage in a minute. Um, fuck, I'm realising how... Um, oh, and that's already on full ball. Okay, um, right. Um, hmm, okay, maybe... Oh, fuck. Okay, alrighty. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Um, well, it might be worth doing then. Is, is, is. We'll move the splitter a little bit further back. Um, so that it's more like. I'll line this up. That. Oh, but then it doesn't have enough clearance! Fuck! Surely that'd be enough. Sweet. And then get rid of that, because we'll have another splitter right here. Except that's slightly off to the side, which apparently it won't allow. It's still slightly off to the side. Okay. That's too much to the other side now. Fucking hell. Okay, maybe if I do it this way. There we go. Please tell me it'll allow it in there. Good. It will. Thank fuck. Um, cool. So that can go into there. That can go off into there. Um, and now this. Although this is going to be extremely... Ah, uh, but then... Ah, uh, but there's even going to be less going off that way. No, this isn't going to work. Okay. Um, not if we want things to be efficient. Um, I'm just going to have to make a new miner. And just get some more iron from elsewhere. Um, or even... No, I don't. There's a fuck ton of iron right here. Um, sweet. We'll just split this stuff. Sounds good. Alright, pop that in there. Pop that in there. Uh, we're going to need another stacky thing. Uh, that's not a stacky thing. That's a stacky thing. Um, might have it like that so it doesn't have to curve around a lot. Have it like that as well. Um, and then it just needs to be another 
constructor rather than assembler. Uh, it needs to go around. Have I encroached another occurrence? Okay, so it's going to have to go awkwardly there. Um, cool. So that will come up there and come across to here. Sweet, that works. We're going to want to make this make iron rods, which will then go into making screws. Fuck! Right. Um, which requires another constructor, which can go here for now. And that can feed into... <laughs> I thought that was a big creature, but no, it's the cliff face. Um, and then that can make nails, or screws, sorry, whatever you want to call them. And then that needs to be fed, fed back into the system somehow. Um, hang on. Before we get to that, we needed them mostly for, what do we call it, rotors, didn't we? Where are the rotors? Let's see if we can fit a merger in there to begin with. Did that need screws as well? No. I think it was this one that was making rotors, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, oh god, I got a splitter right here. Really? Alright, well, where is that being fed from? That's being fed into that. But that's pretty consistent as is. I wonder if we can actually fit a merger in that small space. Uh, organization, logistics actually will be it. Um, merger. Order. Line it up vaguely like that. Have that do that. Oh, that does not look right, but that's fine. Um, fuck, that's not going to work. Okay. Shit. Um, and d -d 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 measure. There. Please tell me that'll work. Oh, that's. I can't even reach into that. Um, shit. Merger. Um, do, 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 merger. No, I can't do that as Team CA. Um, that works. No, then that doesn't work with that. Fuck. Um, can I get this to bugger off for a second? I'm going to get it to go over here. If it'll let me. Why is that not building? It's not building! Why isn't it building? Conveyor but must snap to a conveyor ball or an input output of a building. It's, you, you can make a conveyor belt there. You've got it in blue. Oh, you're being very picky about it, it looks like. Fuck. Right, well, if I make one to begin with there, because you're being bloody picky. Encroaching another clearance. Okay, fine. Make it a little bit further along. It's still not working. Why is it not working? Hang on. Can I just make a normal one? So I go there, and then there, and then yeah. Okay. All right. Maybe if I try rebuilding the merger, maybe something's wrong with the merger itself or splitter. Sorry. Oh fuck! Then that's a lot of stuff to rebuild. Um. Okay. Alrighty. Um, five splitter. Eh, eh, I'm gonna need a jump. Um. Oh, you can actually stack them like that. Fantastic. Okay. We'll, we'll do that then. Um. Oh fuck! I need I need some height. Uh. Okay. So that needs to go from there if I can aim for shit. That will need to go into encroaching another's clearance. Who's clearing? Oh, fuck. Okay. Pop that there. There we go. Now that'll work. And then that went 
over here somewhere, I think. Yeah, here. Sweet. So that's now working. I really hope this next one works, otherwise, what the fuck? Um... I think that's all that needed. Um, yeah, that was all the ones that were connected to it, I think. Unless, uh, oh, no, 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 that wasn't everything it was connected to. It was also connected to that. Um, actually, that's probably better off going into that one. Now we might need to do a bit of a curve with this one. So we're gonna make it go over here. Then up onto there. Then we can have a merger here. Uh, logistics merger. Assuming those Okay, no, there is a problem. Okay, fuck. Um we okay, we might need to make the merger there, just so it doesn't clash with anything else. Sweet. And then we can make this curve back round uh, under here. We'll make a stacky thing um, like that. Make that go up. Make that come down again. Um, oh shit, it's going to be picky. Um, we'll make it sit there, and we'll make it go into there. Fuck, that looks like a mess, but it works. It works. It'll be fine. Um, cool. So now I just need to power the other machine that makes the nails, connect that up to the merger, and we're good. And hopefully there should be more nails coming through. Um, right, power. Do I have a free pole over here? No, not that one. That one? No. That one? No. That one? Yes. Sweet. Power that. Power that. And I'm going to want another pole, just for the sake of having a pole. Um, and then that's going to need to have a conveyor belt. Go around that way. Come around here. Oh, I'm running out of panels. I'm gonna, I may need to refill soon um bring that round over here oh fuck that's actually gonna use up all my things okay i need a top of on those things oh that oh i hate how that clips to the ground so we're gonna fix that anyway oh shit i almost demolished the wrong thing then um okay and do that is it clipping into anything doesn't look like it which is good still not clipping good Right. We're going to need a heck of a lot of those panels. Uh, that's not the thing I need. Take all. That's already being overclocked. Um, and that needs more screws anyway. <laughs> so it's like, fuck. Okay. Right. Now, where are those screws coming from? Because we're going to need to buff up those screws. I'll love it if after this we just have an abundance of screws. Okay, so that's actually getting a steady flow of screws. All things considered. Um, alrighty. Now, ah, oh, this making fair belt's actually nice and visible. Great. Okay, so we're going to bring that down over here. Um, we're going to have it sit on this rock to get a little bit of leverage that we need. And we're going to have it converge into that. Oh, look at that lime and nails. Sweet. Yeah, that makes me very happy. I'll put the little lime ends. That's all right. Um, and then do I have an overclocking thing? Yes, so let's overclock those nails. Now what time is it? It's 10 or 9. We've got plenty of time still left on stream then. Great. Awesome. We can keep going. Um, Alright, so if we head over here, 
Uh, ooh. He needs 10 iron rods per minute. This produces 15 per minute. Okay, yeah, no, we're good. We're good for iron rods. Um, so, but I wonder how that's going to change if I then overclock and put it there. So now it's going to want 15 per minute. How much does this make per minute? That makes 15 per minute. Okay, that's all good then. Sweet. Um, how's it going for iron? It's got more than enough iron. Perfect. Sweet. So that will make a steady stream of screws. That will help the rotors continually make. Now we need more screws for that thing. Not that thing, sorry. Um, that thing. I think it's worth making another screw maker. Which is going to need another constructor. Um, but we're also going to need to supply the iron from somewhere. Okay, that's pretty good for iron. That's going to make 30 iron per minute. That needs 20 iron per minute. Okay, okay so one of them is going to be short staffed. It's, it's short changed at some point. Did not plan that one through. That's alright, we'll sort with that shortage when we get to it. Um, so we need to offload iron from elsewhere. That iron could do with offloading, I see. Or even actually, you know what we could do to fix that issue? We could probably actually make more smelters. Yeah, let's do that. Let's make more smelters rather than just offload iron. Um, so what we're going to want to do is assemble that, create another splitter, organization, no, logistics splitter. Do that. Hook that up. Come on, hook it up. There you go. Hook it up. Yep. And then that will keep building. Um, and then we might just make one kind of around, around here. Oh, come on. Oh, can't afford the fuck. Um, shit. Shit. Okay. Um, uh, uh, uh. where'd they all go? Because I know they're also going somewhere here. Okay, so blam 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 Thank you. Now, where was I? I was over there. That's the wrong one. Uh, three. There we are. Um, all right. Pop that there. Go back to this menu. We need to make a smelter, which is production. Smelter, there we are. Uh, angle it that way. Feed it all in. Tell it to do iron then we're going to need to make a constructor that makes poles feed stuff into that um, then we're going to need to make another construction constructor that makes nails okay so nails there iron rods there and then let's power both of them or the three of them rather. Fantastic. And then, oh, I forget which machine was it. Was it this one? No, it was this one that required the more nails. So let's disassemble that and let's put a merger there. Organization, no, no, I keep doing that. Logistics. Merger, can I? No, come on, wait. What? Oh, that's confusing. Okay. Um. Oh, God, this. Yeah. Yes, that's how I want it to work. God, the arrows are confusing with how they colour when it's behind the thing. Um, cool. Alright, so have that. Connect up to that. Um, 
and then we're going to want to grab the screws from over there we're going to make a big stacking thing so it can go over everything uh, we'll go one two three four um, now yeah that's going to be too steep but what we can do is do that have a bit of a run up do that but then we're going to need a heck of a lot more of the reinforced plates do I have the things to make the plates? And also, I could... How do I get rid of that stuff? Because that line's getting annoying. That list is getting annoying. Because we actually don't need all that stuff anymore. Uh, do, 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 do. Cool. Alrighty, let's go into the crafting bench. And let's make a few reinforced hard plates. Because we've run out of them in storage. Um, reinforced iron plate. I can only make one. Why is that? I need fucking nails. Oh, of course I do. Um... Right, where are my nails? Where are my nails? Are my nails over here? No, that's the poles. Is my nails here? No, that's the concrete. Fucking nails everywhere, except in storage. Um, here we go. Grab that, grab that, grab that. Cool. Um, go in here, grab that. Uh, no, we've got plenty of screws, that's fine. We just need to make reinforced iron plates. Go. Except, fuck, it goes really slowly. And we're going to need more iron plates before we do nails. Right then. That's fine. I'll work with what I've got for now. See what I can do from there. I'll have roughly 30 of the plates. That should give me a decent way. At least we have the water pumps working. Cool. Alright, let's see how that goes. Um, now we have the big stacking thing. Here. Um, oh, we might need more stacking things, it looks like. Um, shit, but then I need actual plates. Right, well, we're going to get more plates then. Um, where do we get the plates from? This one. Okay, here. Okay. Alright, uh, stackable conveyor pole. Now, where is the merger? Merger's over there. Okay. So if I make a stackable thing there. too long. Okay. Cool. Cool. There. No, I only have three left. Okay, well we're going to make more then. And that should make 98. Good. Interesting. Well, whilst that's being made, what else have I been doing with my time? Um, not much, if I'm being honest. Had an assignment for uh, uni where I had to make a marketing campaign for um, vaccination within students, which is for a good cause, but then it's only a hypothetical situation because... As far as I'm aware, the uni's not actually enforcing vaccination on anyone, nor are they marketing real the vaccination. So the marketing stuff is only purely for the assessment. Uh, it's not actually going anywhere. 
um, which is a bit depressing. Um, and then they're really unclear on what exactly they're after. Like, they've gone, oh, don't uh, spend ages drawing, but oh, we want it to look good as well. And one of the marking things on it is innovation. But it's also like, okay, so the things you suggest is like working with like Twitter messages or making a live Facebook page as well as like making three different A4 posters. You want us to innovate about making three different A4 posters. Really? Like, pretty sure they've been done to death. <laughs> Enough for us all to know exactly that there's kind of not much more we could do with it, but sure. So I went from 0% of it done today to 90% of it done. I've made almost all the materials, which is good. So it's mainly just a matter of doing, writing a couple more Twitter messages that hypothetically would be posted over a three week period. And I've already got plenty of those messages, but I want to have enough for every day in that three week period to be sure. Excuse me. Uh, so my teacher can't say, oh, you haven't written enough messages, because then I go, can go, well, there's actually one for each day, so there's always going to be one on their feed on any day that they check. But anyway. Um, but yeah, no. So there's that, and then I need to write up a thing that explains what the intention was of all the different marketing material and what their um, uh, demographic audience was, uh, audience demographic was, which is pretty clear cut from the point that we were given this assignment, which is students in uni. So probably, well, I would say 19 to like 25 year olds, but then there's plenty of uh, uni students who are also like older than that. So, eh. but generally speaking, that kind of age group, young adults. Um, but yeah, no, cool. All right, so that's all the plates made. Um, so that's an assessment that I wasn't the biggest fan of. Maybe like for the first time in ages, I used Illustrator, which I haven't used for a couple of years now. I had to relearn the controls for that, but I got there in the end. Um, I'm still crap at it, but it's serviceable for what I need it to do. Not that, not that the program itself is crap, although I'm not the biggest fan of Adobe stuff. And the UI, the UI in my opinion, is not great. Um, but no, I am also just crap at Illustrator. Um, why is that not working? Conveyor belt is too steep. Fuck, okay, hold up. Uh, do that, that. Uh, encroaching others in clearance. Really? Ah, oh, shit. Uh, but it didn't when it was big. Okay, well, we'll make another one of that. We'll go fish bash bosh. And then. Um, <laughs> right, um, all right, we do that maybe, yeah, and then we can cover background into that, sweet, bit of a long way of doing it, but that should work, cool, and nails are coming along, and that should give more to this thing, um, why isn't there more plates coming through here? Ah, oh, it's because it's trying to fill up this thing. All right, well, we'll just preload it with a few then. That's fine. Um, oh, it's already preloaded with quite a few. Good. Okay. So now that should actually be getting enough screws in order to work. Yeah, that should be fine. Great. Okay, cool. So that should be working a bit faster. So nails being fed into that. Nails are being fed into the rotor thing. Nails, 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 nails. Uh, was there anything else we needed nails for? How's the power going? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Right. We're hitting the ceiling soon, um, so we're going to need to think about making more pumps. Um, holy fuck. Okay, cool. We've got 
we've now got more screws than we do iron rods here. We've got an iron rods um, shortage here. Right, okay. Um, hmm. So all the iron rods are being split between those two things from here. Might be worth splitting some of these and bringing it back to that one. Hey, if I make a stackable. It's going to clip in. Alright, hold on, do that. And then if I make it any higher, it's going to be too steep. Oh, it's too steep already. Never mind. Okay, what if I do it that way? It's encroaching clearance. Okay. Okay, never mind. Um about if I do it like Really? The invalid okay, well if it has an invalid shape, don't let it be blue. Simple. Is it that hard? Um okay, so we have it there. Okay, sweet. Sweet. And then we want it to merge here somewhere. Uh, yes, that's the right way. Um, kill, kill. Uh, that can't go on top. Uh, shit. Okay, hold on. I might need to make a couple more stackables. Um, so I go do do do. If I do it anymore, it's going to be too steep. In fact, it might already be a bit too steep. No, it's fine. Sweet. Good. Good, 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 good. Um, make another stackable. Yeah. Oh, that's going to encroach clearance, isn't it? Um, if I pop it there. Sweet. And then can I curve it round? Um, somehow so that it goes in. Actually, I might make another stackable. Pop it there. Okay. Convey belt it this way. And then feed it in there if it lets me. Also help me. Um. Oh, come on! Yeah, it's encroaching that one's clearance because I want it to go in. Okay, alrighty. Um, maybe if it goes from that angle. No, why is it not working? It's not working. Why isn't it working? Let's make it again. Um, so if I go... Uh, logistics merger yeah and then that should be able to go into it but it isn't so why Hang on. let me let me make one fresh merger invalid aim location maybe that was my problem to begin with um, let's pop one there instead. And then let's have that. No, nope, that's not going to play ball. Okay, it's already elevated to begin with, which is good. Let's have it go there. And then to there. Let's undo that. There into why the fuck isn't it working? Oh, if I've done it from the wrong port, I've done it from the wrong port, haven't I? Right, of course. Um, what? Oh, that's a merger. Oh, so it's all merging into that thing. F 
why I thought it was a splitter. All right, that makes 15 per minute. That needs 25 minutes. Okay, that suddenly makes a lot more sense. Right. Um, fuck. That's a splitter. Right, it's this one that I need to go somewhere. Fuck, I feel like an idiot. Um, okay. In fact, speaking of which, in that case, I should be going into here. If it'll let me, and be, no, that's, why isn't it letting me edit, ah, here we go, now I can edit it. First time in two streams I've had to add to it. Alrighty. Um, now, right. I'll sort that out in a second. Now, where, where's the one I actually needed? Here it is. Um. And so that will get fit into. Oh, it just needs to get fit into that one. No. Yep. There you go. Uh, yep. Fit into that. Or was that the one that was originally in there to begin with? I think that was the one that was originally in there to begin with. Fuck. Okay. Alright, well. Let me scrap all this. And then I can get my bearings in terms of what I need to do. Um, So how am I actually going to get the rods I need? I could split that, because that's going nowhere. But then that might upset that flow. And then it's good to have that because without it, then that would slowly, slowly not be able to catch up. Um, and then that's constantly going into there. And by not being able to put any more there, then it's forcing all the stuff to go down that way. So this can't spare any more. Which is funny because it's actually all oh, the thing over here that I need it for, I'm pretty sure, from memory. Yeah, it is. Uh, okay. And that's the merger there that it all needs to go into. All right, I guess we're doing a whole other smelter setup then. That's fine. We have the infrastructure for it. There we go. Um. Yep. Come on. Up. I'm not in the way anymore, am I? Um, we're going to have it go this way. Oh, come on. Under here. Uh, that way, preferably, so it doesn't clip when everything comes through. That would be nice. Cool. Now let's make a smelter. Um, yeah, good, it doesn't clip. I'm happy. Okay, we want it to go that way. A bit odd, but that's fine. We are going to need it to be a little bit more. Uh, excuse me. Um, do that. Um, we will tell it to make iron, and then we just need to have one constructor to make rods. And that could be fed into the merger back there. With rods, sweet. And you can come all the way back. Missing iron plate nine times one. Well, let's see what's in storage now. Because it's been a while. And we've now fed it with plenty of nails to hurry up. F25. 
24. We'll do what we can with that. Um, I can have that round. Sweet. And then I only have nine again. Fuck. Okay. Right. Let's see how far that gets us. Not very far. About there. It's a start. Okay. Um, well, have I got everything I need to make the stuff? I need more nails. Uh, I'm going to need more iron plates. Okay. Right. Fuck. Uh, actually, what am I doing? I should have plenty of nails in storage. Oh, well, that'll be nice about having these going as well, because they're not going to go into storage. They're just going to go straight to the things, which is where I need them. Um, which will be good. Cool, so we've got that. Plates. Platey, 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 plates. Um, do, 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 do. where is it? No, it wasn't over here. Um, it was over there. We're further away than where I thought we were. Right, I actually need to make the plates to begin with. Um, right. There we go. So that should get us 85 of them. So yes, I think definitely next time, I, uh, before I play this, I'm going to have this game run for a lot longer than what I have been having it. So maybe rather than having it only run for like a day, I might have it run, not consecutively, like I'll have breaks between, but like I might have it run for maybe two days um, whilst I'm doing my work just so I can continue making stuff. Because I really thought a day would have generated more than what I've got here. But that's, that's fine. We'll work around it. Um... Yeah, in terms of other stuff, um, small update with what Scream Stream will have after Alien. Um, I have decided that um, after Alien, we are going to do we're going to do a small mix of things rather than one particular game, so it's got a bit of variety. Number one, next uh, after Alien, the next time we do Scream Stream, we're actually going to start it with a game called Dagon, which is the thirty-minute game, which. Um, apparently it uh, adapts one of HP Lovecraft's stories by the same name, Dagon. I didn't realize there was one called Dagon. Granted, I haven't finished reading, uh, Lovecraft stuff. Um, so I might have to read that story in advance to see how it compares with how they've adapted it in the game. And then after that 30 minute game, um, we're also probably going to play a game called Misao, which is a top down pixel art horror game that is a little bit puzzly. Um... And that was a game that I have played before, but never, not all the way through and very little of. And even then, I wasn't the one actually playing it. I was watching someone play it. Because um, a few of my friends and me last year um, played it over Discord, watching someone, uh, uh, w watching one of us play it. Um, but I have got the game, never actually started it up. So I will play that, and that shall be our main horror game to try and get through story-wise. And if for whatever reason we get bored of Misa in a single session, um, then we can swap over to Dead by Daylight. Um, so yeah, so ne the, the, the next stream after Alien will be Dagon and Misa, and then after that, if there's a point where we get bored of Misa one night, we'll swap over to Dead, for Dead, to Dead by Daylight for a bit of variety. But Misa will be the one that we're actually going to try and complete. Um... And that'll be a nice change from um, Alien, which is uh, uh, Shoots McGee, whereas um, uh, Misa is more of like a puzzle them up. So that'll be good. That'll be fun, I think. Oh, also, before I forget, I completely forgot to mention at the start. Um, 
if you've read any of the reviews on my website in the arcade.com you might be familiar with a game called if um on a winter's night for travelers which i absolutely adored um and gave a glowing review which absolutely in my opinion deserved um it is now released on steam so if you're not if you're like me where you don't normally go onto itch.io to grab your games it is now available on steam um so i highly recommend you pick it up it is free which is another reason why you should go and pick it up because oh my god it should not be free it should be paid because it is so good like even though it is a fairly short experience like it's it's still a decent one and it's it's not too short like and it's short but it still takes a few hours to complete and it's a puzzle one it's not like it's a walk em up game that will only take you half an hour it's like no it will it will vary depending on how like, hard you personally find the puzzles um which I think is great. Um, and the puzzles are good. The stories are good. Beautiful imagery, despite it being uh, pixel art. And it uses the pixel art actually fairly cleverly, um, I would argue. Um, so yeah, highly recommend it. It's on Steam. It's for free. Um, if you do want to support the, develop the developers, you can buy what's called a supporters pack, I saw. Oh shit, what the fuck? fucking hate those things um but i did see you could buy a supporters pack which essentially gives you i think the soundtrack as i think that was an wasn't it an art book hang on let me go into my steam and check that actually let me get myself off the conveyor belt first so i don't um fall away uh if on a winter's night for travelers uh no where is it yeah, digital art book and original soundtrack. Um, but yeah, so I highly recommend picking that up. Um, like, the game's fantastic. I'm sure they would appreciate the support. Um, but yes, it's a good game. Go and play it. Now, was that the rods or was that... Oh, God. No, it's the rods. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. And then that needs to go over here. Was it to this one? Yeah, it was to this one. Okay. So what we probably actually should do is what? No, I wanna I wanna put down a thing. Why is it ping? I just wanna put down a thing. How do I get out of ping mode? What have I done? I don't know what I did then, but I'm out of it now. I don't know what that was about. Um, right, wait. I'm not sure what happened there. Okay. Um, oh god, we want to merge it somehow. I didn't think about this. Shit. Um, that's not a merger. No, that's a splitter. Fuck. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay. Um. Uh, unless. Oh, but then that's gonna send the stuff everywhere. Well, like, then again, it probably is needed everywhere. Um. I mainly. Oh, it'll have to do. Um, all right, that's fine. We will, yep, undo that. Yep, Q, uh, logistics merger. Uh, yes, there. And so we will pop that one into there, pop that one into there. We will scrap that. And then, ooh, ooh, I didn't think about this. Um, That's going to be too steep. Yeah, that's going to be too steep. Get rid of that one. Is it going to be encroaching a clearance if I put it there? Okay, that was too steep. Fuck. Okay. Uh, eight. Uh, 
Oh, that's going to be... Oh, that might be enough, though. No, it's too steep. Shit. Okay. Um, what if I do it so it's like that? Invalid shape. Why is it curving really weirdly like that? Okay, maybe it needs a little bit more room. Protein on this clearance. Fuck! Okay, alright. That's... Okay, so that angle's not gonna work. Shit. Right. Um... Gotta think of something else. Alright. What if... We did it from here. Would this work? Seems to work so far. From there, yes. Yes! And then we just need power at all. How's power going? Power's going good. Oh fuck, it's becoming like a... Jesus, everything's everywhere. Um, okay. Uh, no, power, thank you. Are you powered? You're yellow. Alright, you're making nails, not the not the stuff that I'm actually making. Uh, I think I think the stuff I was needing was over here? Yes, that's red, so yes, that's not powered. Which, is, which means it's the new stuff. Okay, we're gonna need to make that come over here. Power that, so that's actually gonna start smelting. Power that. Bring that forward in case we ever need it down here again. Um, and that's it that one and that should start just making shit that'll make 15 per minute yeah cool <laughs> right how are the modulators um mod not modulators how are the iron like structured module things going um i wonder if that's enough to that'll be enough to hand in the basic steel production stuff so the stuff that we actually wanted to do at the beginning before we got sidetracked with water pumps we can actually do now because we've waited long enough and go milestone reach steel production unlocked foundry grants access to new simple steel parts all right cool well we've been going for almost two hours it's 11 o'clock i almost want to stop there but let's see what else whether we can do anything more before we stop uh, vehicular transport, don't really give a shit about, although, no, I took all of it, so we don't have enough modular stuff for it. Um, advanced steel production, oh, we could get a minor mark too. Ooh, but we can't make steel pipes yet, in fact, we haven't even got steel being mined yet. Um, and we're going to need a lot more conveyor belts for that, and we do not have the panels for that, so that's not really an option. Um, we could conceivably do this though, and all three of those look like they could be good. Hypertubes will be great for fast travel and stuff, but we need to be producing those two things which we don't produce. Um, that would also be great, but we need to produce those two things that we don't produce. Um, so I think we'll do the improved melee combat module tonight before we stop, um, and then after that we might have to give it a break there. Um, so that we have enough resources next time to actually make conveyor belts. Because currently, excuse me, because currently we don't. And that could be quite annoying if we're going to go and find some steel and make enough plates to go across planes and planes and planes to get back here. Because it's probably going to be a site C. Because we've got site A here, pumps are site B, so site C would be the steel. Um, so this is going to be the only one we're going to do tonight, um, left. I feel like we've made good progress though tonight. I'm quite happy with what we've done tonight so far. So even if we stopped here, I'd be quite happy. But we can do this, so we're going to do this. So we're going to select that master, and we're going to hand in what we've... We're going to hand in what we've got. Oh. Oh. Alrighty. That's fine. We, we can collect the stuff. Um, well, first off, we're going to need to make reinforced iron plates, which means we need to get more nails will be over here. This is starting to look like my old safe now, just minus the tubes. Uh, yeah, grab a thousand. Uh, 
Okay, um, get that going. Is that going to be enough? No, that's not going to be enough. But we'll make it at least. Alrighty. And then what's going to run out? F it's going to be the panels that run out first. Okay, so we're going to need to get more panels noted. Let's at least make what we can. <sighs> Almost there. So that Nintendo news about Chris Pratt was weird. Um, not sure I can really see him as Mario. Um, it was a bit weird, weird to death that they didn't choose Charles Martinet for that role. And I know they said that he was going to be in other roles, although they didn't say what. Smaller roles, but still, come on. Um, Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong? I mean, mm, could work. But I also just can't see him working as Donkey Kong in terms of like, the voice. Just the voice and how he sounds. Like, like, I can't imagine Donkey Kong with a voice, like, straight up at all, to be honest. Um, so I'm not really sure how that's going to work, but sure, they can give it a go. Okay, one more. Cool, that's enough. Pod's not back. Okay, we've got all the things except we need. What do we need? We need more rotors. We need more copper wire. We need. We've got enough cable, so it's just copper wire and rotors we need. Um, but yes. So and also, do we need a Mario film? I don't think we need a Mario film. Like, Mario's never been about the story, so you're not doing it for the story. So which means that you're doing it either for the art or you're doing it for the money. And like, I think. For the art wise, if you're you're good with the games, so it's definitely in the money. Um, so yeah, I, I guess that makes sense in the sense that they've got bankable, um, what do you call it, star power by choosing that group. Um, but still, not not the biggest fan personally. Um, oh, I'm gonna need more copper wires. A thousand five hundred, not a thousand. Whoops. Um, but, you know, um, I mean, we all kind of saw how crappy the original Super Mario film was. Like, even if you're like me and you haven't seen it, you've heard how infamous it is for being crap. So, not sure why they feel okay to try again. At least it's Illumination that's making it. I mean, I've seen a fair few people shit on Illumination, but I feel like Illumination aren't actually that bad. Like, their animation's pretty good. Um, am I a fin fan of Minions? Personally, no, not really. I haven't actually seen the film, but I'm not a fan of minions kind of turning into, like, the big thing that they are. They're just a little yellow dude. But anyway. Um, but I remember when I saw Despicable Me for the first time, I quite enjoyed that, both as a kid. And I think if I went back to it now, I don't, I was all, I would also enjoy it. A lot of people didn't seem to like Sing. At least on YouTube, anyway, as reviewers. I personally quite enjoyed Sing. But I also know that my movie taste is a little bit weirder than my game taste. Like, I know that a lot of... Uh, movies that I like, a lot of people seem to hate. Um, like, a lot of people seem to not like the Alice in Wonderland um, reboot live action thing. I actually quite liked Alice in Wonderland live action. At least it's better than the current live action shit we've got. Because it was actually a somewhat original what its storyline was. Um, like, yes, it's all well and good to make Beauty and the Beast suddenly a really feminist tale. But it's not that different from the original storyline, really. It's still the same through line, same story, just with some slight tweaks. Um, meanwhile, the Alice in Wonderland story, I feel like, is vastly different to the original film um, and takes more influence from um, the books in terms of what to pull from it, like the Jabberwocky. I think the Jabberwocky appears from Through the Looking Glass, I think. I haven't actually read Through the Looking Glass. I read the original book, but not Through the Looking Glass. And I like how it also... Tim, it felt like Tim Burton also took a little bit of um, inspiration from the American Mickey games, just with how sort of slightly twisted it was. But then again, that's also just Tim Burton, so that just may be Tim Burton being Tim Burton. Um, 
you know, oh, in fact, fun fact, I almost considered playing the American Mickey games on stream for Scream Stream, um, but I've already started the first game before I started streaming, and I was like, either I continue streaming from where I'm up to in that game, which for anyone watching, even on the VODs, is going to be annoying, because they're going to have missed at least a good third of the game already, or I started over again, which I don't like a sense of, because the first game, which I'm still playing through, is fucking frustrating at points. So, we're not doing that. Um, highly recommend those games anyway, though, because I am enjoying them. Okay, cool. Now we can hand this in. And bish, bash, bosh. Yep, cool. Cable. And go. And go. And go. Sweet. Now, what do we need to do to make that better um, melee weapon? Was it a melee weapon or was it? Yeah, it was a melee weapon. Uh, Xeno Basher. Oh, you need to make two of the Xeno Zappers. Which requires... Of course, it requires reinforced fucking plates. There's always something. There's always one you need more of. Um, okay. That'll do. Uh, da, 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 da. Make Xeno Zapper. Why is the bar gone off the thing? Um, okay, Zena Basher, and then we need more cable, which I can deal with, if I can get through my mess. Um, uh, terms of Marvel films that I've watched since last time, I have now watched, as I up to last time? I don't remember where I got up to last time I was streaming. Um, but the main things I watched is I, I I watched all the Dark World, which I don't think I'd watched prior to last stream. And I actually really, I kind of enjoyed it. Like, it was okay. It wasn't the first film in the world. It was all right. It was all right. Um, cool, got Xena Basher now. Um, and then I also watched Iron Man 3, which, like, it's kind of just Iron Man 2. But instead of whips, it's re Wolverine regeneration, breathing fire stuff. But the antagonist is basically the same dude, just different skin. And he's now, he was originally um, disabled rather than um, just a crappy business owner like it was in, in number two. Like, it felt like similar dynamics, which was really like, eh, eh. I mean, the dude from 2 is a bit more pathetic, but anyway. Like, there are bits of 3 that I really liked. Like, I loved the storyline that dealt with um, Iron Man trying to wrangle how he was coping after New York. That was that was quite nice. That was clever. You don't see that a lot in films. Um, but yeah, no. Um, aside from that, and, and also the stuff with the kid was fun. But aside from that... It was average. It was okay. Would I watch it again? Probably not. Um, and since then, I haven't actually watched any more Marvel films, because the following night I watched uh, Endgame and Infinity War again with my family, and I haven't really sat down to watch any more. Um, there was the Party Thor episode that came out after I had my stream last week, and that was quite good. It was really strange watching Party Thor and then um, watching... End game, because they've both got similarities and how they've kind of gone like they both drink a fair amount. That they're, they're both sort of partyish. One's just loud party. One's just like quiet in home party and like playing games. But like, granted, that was more Korg than it was him. But like, eh. Anyway, um, yeah, that should be it for this stream. I'm actually just gonna quickly top off my health the next stream so I don't have to worry about it then or even when I'm playing next um, we're going to equip that equip that equip that no I forgot no I want to equip all of them come on sweet cool so I am quite happy with where we've gone up to um, so we'll probably leave it there for now 
I will let this game run for a bit for a couple days. Um, again, not consecutively. Like, I'm not going to waste power ridiculously like that. And I'm going to be doing stuff in the background whilst it's running. Like, I'll probably do uni work in the background and just have this on. Um, and then periodically check it to make sure everything's still running. Um, and it's got fuel. Um, cool. Um, so, in the meantime, um, join me on Wednesday night when we're going to finish... Uh, Alien Fireteam Elite, or Aliens Fireteam Elite, rather, sorry. Um, hopefully we finish it. I really want to finish it at this point, because we've been on it for ages. I haven't played it in two weeks, because I haven't played it since that stream either. Um, just haven't got random. I haven't felt like it. Um, ooh, can I... Why is it two out of four on the rebar gun? I saw that. Oh, it's slot number two out of the hand. Oh, I see. That makes sense. Okay, cool. Anyway, I am going to say good night. Enjoy your evenings or mornings or afternoons or whatever time it is for you when you're watching this stream slash VOD. Um, the VOD will be up on YouTube momentarily. Um, so if you've missed any part of the stream, then go for it. Although, granted, there's only been one viewer this entire time, and I'm not sure if that's just maybe me on my laptop, even though I'm logged in on Twitch. I don't know whether it counts or not. Who knows? Um... But anyway, so yeah, I will see you Wednesday night, or you'll probably just see me when you see me, if you're just watching the VODs. Either way, enjoy the rest of your night. This is going to be awkward with the work. Actually, you know what? That's not going to have work because you need to do shift and that with the... Sorry, I've done the wrong... I did the wrong shortcut. So instead of pressing the shortcut that cut the thing, it hasn't actually done anything. Sorry about that. Yes, enjoy the rest of your night.